Greetings fellow customizer. Today I am uploading part two of two of the Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas custom Air Jordans. This custom pair of Air Jordans was very difficult and very complex at times and I am very grateful that the collector gave me a lot of freedom. And I am very pleased with the finished product. If you like watching these videos, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Also leave a comment down below as to what you were currently working on. If you caught the first video, you saw me paint the portraits on the inner areas of the sneakers and now it's time to paint the details on the outer sides. Again, I am using blue Sorol transfer paper to first transfer my line work. I am using a basic color pencil to sketch on a sort of swirl pattern on this area of the sneaker. that same leather die I used for the toe box, I am also using for the sides of each sneaker. While that first layer of the leather die dries, I am adding some of the turquoise blue. I have no fear on these areas cracking, these spots where I am putting the flat black directly with none of the black leather dye first. This is now my second layer of the green leather dye. With the help of a little bit of tissue paper, you can trace out the exact sized areas of each sneaker that you need. By flipping around this traced and cut out piece, I can get the exact area all the way around the shoe that I need.
If you look carefully, there's a tiny nook here where the flat black didn't reach. I have a special custom olive green and vanilla mix that I am putting on the toe box. And I am also using that same special mix for the swoosh. The areas directly behind the swish are a mix of mustard and vanilla. I decided to remove some of the chili red that I had previously put on the heel of the sneaker to make room for this larger typewriter. Of course, I needed to customize the Jumpman tag. This area directly underneath the Las Vegas sign was pretty important to me and I had been wanting to put Ralph Steadman art scattered about the shoe. I said why not put one of my favorite sketches right here. As well, just as I was painting this tiny skull, I remembered I have this entire area on the toe box blank and the perfect size for a little bit more Ralph Steadman art.
I needed to put some type of protection on these custom fear and loathing in Las Vegas Air Jordans, so I chose the satin four coat urethane finisher. And these are the complete Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas Air Jordans. If you have any questions, reach out to me through my Instagram or my website. Both links are down below as are links to all the products I used in this video. Big thanks to Angelus Direct for the paints. And thanks guys for watching.